What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We've got another movie reaction for you. Ready Player One. <laughs> if you didn't know, we stream over on the Nikki and Steven live channel. Link should be popping up here. There's one down below. It's Every fun. single weekend. It's so fun. Yeah, we have a blast with, with our streams and our movie nights. But come join us. Come subscribe and hit that bell so you know when we're live. Great time. You ready for Ready Player One? Yes. Let's go. Song. <laughs> Columbus, Might as Ohio, well jump! Jump! Okay. It's not that far into the future. <laughs> what is going on? Virtual boxing yeah. there? <laughs> That's awesome. I want a Pizza Hut delivery. Delivery by drone. This is like the good rock with the big hair. Oh, oh, what are you doing? I'll take, I want to take that class. <laughs> Everyone's living in VR. That's funny. You don't need a destination when you're running on an omnidirectional treadmill. That's dope. What the? The Oasis. The oh, Oasis. that's cool. It doesn't matter where you live. You could just go you to go the Oasis. Go wherever you want. Yeah. Oh. Oh, what? Minecraft! <gasps> Minecraft! You can do anything. Go anywhere. You can ski down the pyramids. I would so much rather be there, Mount though. Everest. What do we mean? Batman. Batman! <laughs> Whatever people want to do, they do it in the Oasis. It's where we make friends. Locate H. That's pretty wild. That is pretty cool. It's like a real world version of The Sims. <laughs> Oh shit. Planet Doom. The most dangerous place in the universe. Oh, like Doom, the game. Figures H would be there. Oh, oh, Freddy Krueger! Freddy Krueger just got obliterated. Is that Daito? Daito and show! This is cool. Everyone starts the same, but the more coin you make, the more you level up. <laughs> hey, Ma, can you get off the couch, please? Losing your shit means. Oh well, no! No, no, no. Losing your shit. No, no, no. <laughs> Jeez. The Oasis was the brainchild of James Halliday. He and his partner Ogden Morrow released the first Oasis build. Hey, Shaun of the Dead. We're only three years away from there. He was like a god. People loved him. He doesn't look like he's all there. He's kind of living in La La Land. On January 7th, 2040, he died. Mm -hmm. oh. And what he left behind changed everything. Do you want Star Wars stuff at your funeral? Star Wars flower arrangements there? I would rather not talk about my funeral. If you're watching this, I'm dead. Super. I created what we in the biz call an Easter egg. First person to find the egg, I've hidden in excess of half a million dollars, uh, half a trillion dollars worth. Half a trillion dollars. I created three keys. Damn. The keys aren't just laying around under a rock. <laughs> that would be crazy cool. So, this is like Tarkov, where if you get killed, you lose everything. Word. Very cool intro. Is it weird that the Oasis feels like something that could happen? Not that far from now with all of the VR we have going on. I feel like I feel like there used to be something called the Oasis, no? But the challenge to win the first key was a race designed by Halliday that was so hard no one had ever finished. The Sixers work for Iowa. They're the second largest company in the world. Like me, they spend all their time studying pop culture that Halliday was obsessed with. They're just following the orders of the head of Iowa. Oh, this guy. I gotta go to the back. Ooh, so you can skim coins from crashed cars? That's just sad, man. <laughs> this feels like a extreme video game version of, uh, like, Willy Wonka. <laughs> Is that the DeLorean? Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Love it. Hopefully it goes faster. I like faster. The, the arm tattoo and, like, the... Hopefully it goes faster than 88 miles an hour, though. Word. Well, the other one did, too.
Damn, dude! Oh, oh shit. shit! Dude, I want that truck. The girl, I think it's Artemis. I've seen all her walkthroughs, her Twitch streams. <laughs> Twitch. Dude, oh this is God. so cool. That would be. Is, is this a real game? Is this a real? One? <laughs> Oh shit. Coming like a wrecking ball. No? Anyone? Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Get the coin. This is already so much fun. It is. Oh, oh shit, that is over. Jurassic World in this shit. Watch out. Oh, King, King Kong. Kong. Oh shit. <laughs> They got some uh, crazy. I always obstacles. think that it's him that's like. These obstacles are insane. I don't think you got it. No, you don't got it. Oh no! Damn, Kong. <laughs> Where's Dominic Toretto when you need him? I love her hair. Yeah, that's dope. Damn, I love that bike. Oh, H. Could, well, he's my friend, but he could fix it for you. This is my workshop. Touch nothing. <laughs> oh, it's a Pee Wee Herman bike. It is. <laughs> it's in the basement of the Alamo. There's like Easter eggs all over the place in yeah. this freaking movie already. James Halliday's favorite first person shooter. What? Oh. Goldeneye. Oh. And his favorite food was Hot Pockets. Favorite restaurant was Chuck E. Cheese. Song Chuck E. Cheese. Video killed the radio star by the Buggles. Yeah. I sucked. I sucked at Goldeneye. That's better. Is that Spaceballs? What? The Winnebago flying with the wings. Oh, yeah. It's, um, what is it called? Lone Star. Everything changes. Jim, everything evolves. This is so wild. Mm-hmm. Why can't we go backwards? Go back! Ten backwards. Really fast. Fast as we can. Bill and Ted did it. Yeah, Bill and Ted. He just found the key! Does that mean do the whole race backwards or just go through the finish line backwards? Oh, well, she has a Hello Kitty sticker on her bike. I saw the Hello Kitty. Cool. This is cool. If you could find something like that. Fucking cool. That's cool. Nice racing, Padawan. <laughs> Padawan. Love it. Get yourself a clue. Use it well. Twenty thousand for the holy hand grenade. That's a steal. Oh, he's gonna spend all his new coin. X one haptic boot suit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God, he's got a password written on a post it note. Oh, my God. <laughs> Of course, he's some big, giant buff dude. I see right through you. I do. I do. <laughs> I have another job for you. Uh, Parzival, you want him off the scoreboard. Can you do that? Avatars are going to be on him like hoes on Santa. hey -o. You never lick. Bite straight to the chocolatey center of the Tootsie Pop. <laughs> okay. Three times my normal fee. Done. Wait, really? I should have asked for five. Is four still on the table? <laughs> There's five of us on the big board now. But also, she reminds me of a creature in the movie Avatar. A creator who hates his own creation. Better be good at riddles. Right. <laughs> Beetlejuice! Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice! 
Everybody take your screenshots, quick! Oh, hey, Goro! <laughs> Remember when you said that I look like Goro from the Mortal Kombat movie? I'm still offended by that. Alien! No, space balls? Space balls? <laughs> that is not funny. That was pretty funny. I would totally be a Jedi as an avatar in this world. Holiday purposely removed every mention of her except for this one. That's weird. Why? Is this something linked to the next key? You see, here is the rosebud at the center of his story. Rosebud. Sims! A bit. 10 p.m. There's something I want to show you. So is only the first task a race, and then they just got to find the clues after that? I don't know. Maybe it's other games, I think. Is that a prince outfit? Should I go more... Really? <laughs> you didn't wear the outfit from your favorite movie. Don't be that guy. I am that guy. She could actually be a 300 pound dude who lives in his mama's basement in suburban Detroit. <laughs> I love it so much. Dude, he gives me Vin be. Diesel vibes. Yes! Thank you. Uh, That's exactly what I was thinking. This would be such a trip to live in a world like this. I need the soundtrack. I need the soundtrack right now. Is that a Harley Quinn? Yes, that is Harley Quinn. Yeah! <laughs> Do you think she's playing him? Maybe. I'm just loving the music. This is awesome. The music is very good. <laughs> I need to know if this is a dude. My name's Wade. What? Are you crazy? You don't tell anyone who you are. You can't use your real name. You don't know anything about me. We've never met. I do know you, Artie. I'm in love with you. Oh, Whoa, no. dude! Oh, that's dope. That is dope. The Back to the Future music. Turns everything back in time, 60 seconds. That's fucking cool. This isn't a game, Z. I'm talking about real-world consequences. My dad died in a loyalty center. Damn. That sucks. The real-world identity of Parzival is Wade Watts. How do you get his last name? Mm. He did that easy, huh? Yeah. I guess anybody who's registered in the game? But if this war remains in the Oasis, then you can't do anything. Feels like this dude's like the same character in every movie I've seen him in. Who's he on? He was in Batman. Oh. He was, thought he was doing business with Bane and got destroyed by him. Where am I? IOI Plaza. You're a hologram in the real world. In the Oasis? You get unlimited weapons, magic items, ships. You want the ship from Defender? You want the Millennium Falcon? Yeah, I do. Here's the first thing that I would do is convert all the schools on Ludus to replicas from the Breakfast Club. Love this. It's a trap. Faber College from Animal House. Tell me you didn't direct Fast Times at Ridgemont High or Animal House. You think I'm a corporate asshole that I don't appreciate pop culture, but for... As you're being fed all the information yeah. through an earpiece, you idiot. Drink tab, play Robotron, listen to Duran Duran. I crack open a tab. I put on some Duran Duran. I play Robotron. That's this... Uh, what a douche. So if you want to know what I really think, I think you're full of shit. Good job. Solid. Wade Owen Watts. Unit 56K, Columbus Stats. You were last seen entering your trailer three days ago. You haven't left since. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. They're going to blow up his fucking house. Oh my god, dude. Oh 
I did not see that coming. Holy shit. IOI came from in the real world. They oh shit. Wherever you are. <clears throat> Dude. Artemis? My real name is Samantha, but yeah. Aww. It's around the world. It's, it's all the same in the Oasis. She's a cutie. You said I, I would be disappointed when I met you, but I'm not. I've lived with it my whole life. You don't have to pretend. Why do I feel like the the birthmark or what makes her more attractive? You have a birthmark. So what? Aww. <laughs> See if I hurt you, I'm, I'm sorry. Did you just call me Z? Oh my god, did I? You can call me whatever you want. You forget what it's like to be outside. Yeah. This is moving like really fast for me. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I just figured it out. <laughs> I love her. Oh shit! <laughs> that would be me all day. The place where the leap wasn't taken. Where the date was. At the movies. Halliday kept track of every movie he ever watched, the week and the year he watched it. I'm really digging this story. This is fun. I do, I do too. I like this a lot. A creator who hates his own creation. Oh, The Shining. The Shining. And it's based on the best selling book by Stephen King. Who hated the it's movie. a good ass movie too. Da, da, da. This is the this the music. Oh my god, it's so good. Oh my god, you're like in the movie. That's so cool. All work and no play. Oh my god. I've never seen The Shining. Is it really scary? Oh god. I love the biggest dudes like, is it scary? <laughs> ah, the elevators! Red Rob. Red Rob. Red Rob. Red Rob. <sighs> no, thank you. No, thank you. Oh my god, the elevator's gonna start bleeding. Such a good movie. The Shining. So good. <gasps> yes! Dude, this is so cool. I fucking love this shit. Is this gonna kill him, though? The p Ah, look at him! Uh-oh. This is so trippy that you could go into the movie. This is so awesome. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, uh, hi, naked lady. <laughs> can you do me a favor and tell me where are all the exits? This is fucking dope. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bitch, here's Johnny. Ah, the snow maze. I fucking love this. Come on, little boy. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh, bitch. <laughs> yes, the kitchen. I fucking, this is so good. <laughs> He's like, I'm done. I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> okay, Mr. Dead Guy. Cool if I lead? Ah! <laughs> So cool. That is awesome. Now we just have to win the Shining Challenge. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I love this shit. Oh, shit. I'm going to 
to delay them. Wait, oh shit. You will be remanded to the nearest IOI loyalty center until your debt is paid in full, including any interest. This is fucked. I love the music. The music is so fucking good with the Back to the Future shit. She might be a 300 pound dude named Chuck. Who lives in his mama's basement in suburban Detroit. Right? <laughs> I just love how the story just continues to like unravel. Oh, bitch. Is it show or Daito? Daito. My real name is Toshiro. Samantha got us a message. <laughs> this is so cool. I love this shit so much. Sent every guy they had into that sector until they found the right fortress. Show? Aww. Yeah, I'm 11, so what? <laughs> His real name is Zo. <laughs> You're the world's most badass 11 year old ever. He knows. Shut up, let him tell me. <laughs> you saw Sorrento's rig, right? How much about Sorrento's rig do you remember? Kind of everything. And the password? The guy had a fucking password on a post it note right on the side, like a ding dong. Um, what is happening? That looks real sus. Damn, that's fucking whack. Oh, she dude. can't take it off? I don't think she can. Hey, newbie, get to work. Work violation. Uh, yikes, dude. Hi, Rock, how are we doing? To be honest, I think I need physical therapy because it's not. Is he orbiting? <laughs> so I don't fucking care about your shit! Dude. dude, this fucking douche. <laughs> you killed my mom's sister. That was a corporate decision, not personal. Not personal. So he really doesn't know he's the oasis. He thinks he's back in his office in the real world. But That's dope. <laughs> he's stupid enough to leave his password line. There you go. Dope. Doesn't seem like the smartest construction to leave that in the... It's like, let's put the escape in the pod with them. What's his password? Okay, it's capital B, zero, 55, man, 69. But, but Artie, you, you need to go. Boss man. <laughs> he wishes. <laughs> Shit. Um, report to security or your coin count will be reset to zero. We need to find them. their kids, Nolan. Man the hell up as you want to take this and go after them yourself. Yeah, boss man, sixty nine. Fine. <laughs> Fucking clown. That's the coolest game and chair around, by the way. Word. That's pretty dope. I'm here talking to all of you now because our future's being threatened. A force field around the third challenge. I know it's kind of a groaner, but I found love. Oh. <laughs> Oh shit. Are you willing to fight? I am Parzival of the High Five. Avengers! <laughs> Simple! <laughs> I'm in, let's go. Let's do this. Dude, this movie is so much fun. It is, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Cap on your left. Yeah. <laughs> Solid. This is fucking tight. I love it. Yeah, bitch. Oh shit. All out war. Holy shit. <laughs> See how it suck at this part of the game? Because it's requiring stealth. 
Well, I would puke because first person. I would just puke. But I just, I don't care for stealth. Yeah, about 10 million years, so we should be fine. Ufaz Bathad. About that. About that 10 million years? Yeah, no. First to the key! Yay, Fortnite! Halo! <laughs> Halo. <laughs> I don't know what that, that I one was. It was like Spawn. Oh my god, I love this. I love it! Let's go, DeLorean. That's so cool. <laughs> I, I love this so much. Dope. Get that coin. <laughs> oh shit! It's Chucky. Get out of here. <laughs> Fucking Chucky. <laughs> That's freaking amazing. I love that. <laughs> oh shit. It's fucking Chucky. <laughs> oh shit. The little kids. Look at the kids go. Ninja Turtles. <laughs> All the Halo players. Very evil music. Is that um Is that, um... What the fuck? Mecha Godzilla. There you go. I couldn't think of Godzilla for some reason. That feels like an unfair advantage right there. Oh, no. <gasps> no! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, That's so dope. Dope. This is so awesome. Oh, bitch. Oh, shit. No. Oh, bitch. No. <laughs> oh man, dude. Fuck Mega Godzilla up. Bitch, 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 bitch. Get him, girl. Oh, she put the birthmark on her avatar? I love it. Aww. That's great. What's that? Oh, I, what were those things? I totally forget what that is. I totally remember it, though. <laughs> oh, damn it. Those were awesome. Dunzo, Boss Man 69, bitch. Bitch. Shit. No. Yeah, bitch! Dope. Terminator? Yeah. <laughs> As he's falling in the fire. Wait, no, 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 no. Get together, Sixer. Back to Reeseball. He's smart. He's smart. Oh, bitch. <laughs> Good thing he went on that spending spree. Trying to know, yeah. He lost. It's not about winning. Well, there's a secret in adventure. And you don't find it by winning. You find it by wandering around in a dark room. Really? Let me finish it for you. Oh, shit. I will never let the future of the Oasis rest in your hands, Nolan Sorrento. Well, that's fine. 
Three easy steps. Wait, I thought you were bluffing. You know that kills all of us, right? I've got ten years worth of shit inside of me. <laughs> ten years worth of shit? <laughs> Campers. They're not good. Ah, he's ah, fucking Street a Fighter! Again. Love it. Street Fighter, right? Yeah. Right? Okay. Oh. Bitch. 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 Bitch! Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. You son of a bitch! No, no, no! Oh, shit. What an asshole. See, he's still alive. Oh, what? Extra <laughs> life. <laughs> <laughs> Punk ass. I'm Toshiro. You know me as Daito. <laughs> How are you still playing? Extra life. Long story. Sorry I shot you. Do I have to wear a sign saying, I am 11 years old? Shoot me first. No thanks. Dude, give me a hug. Ninjas don't hug. <laughs> Ninjas don't hug. <laughs> Finale. Tell me something good. Maybe you should leave this to me, Nolan. She's like, you already fucked this up already. I'll take care of this. First Easter egg ever put in a video game. The creator's name. What's going on, man? I can't see shit. Percival just got the crystal key. Get the key. Come on. Like, stand up. Do you want it or not? Bitch, I'm trying to get there. Chill out, Gandalf. I love the music. I do too. It's so good. Yay! <laughs> oh shit. Oh, bitch, bitch, bitch now. <gasps> oh. He knows this shit in real life, girl. <laughs> He's like, what the fuck? <laughs> oh shit. Get it, kid. Oh. <laughs> Later. Bye. Kind of in a hurry here. Might want to just hurry up and sign it. This is the moment that Halliday made Moral sign over his shares in Gregarious. I won't make the same mistake you did. I just needed to be sure. Aww. I love this music. Oh, that's just me. Long time ago. <laughs> the button. If you push it, the whole simulation shuts down. Oh, shit. Oh, I said it earlier in the movie, but this has such Willy Wonka vibes. Yeah. It's like you made the right decision at the end. We know what you did here. You turn around and walk out of here while you still can. Yeah, bitch. Yeah. What are you going to do with that, dude? As terrifying and painful as reality can be it's also kind of etch a sketch only, on there the only place that you can get a decent meal <laughs> true Ooh, there it is. was that a commodore i think so <laughs> he was crying how that's amazing drop the gun now yeah is halliday really dead yes and what are you? Goodbye, Parcival. Thanks for playing my game. What a story. I love this. Take the leap! Ogden Morrow? You can call me Og. There's something I need to do first. I'm taking the leap. Yeah. Aww. Good job. Are 
you guys? The people you need right now, lawyers, they want your signature, Wade. I'm splitting it with my clan. We're gonna run things together. They're like, yeah, let's go. <laughs> I've been watching a little closer than most. <gasps> He's... Oh! You're the curator? Well played, Oswald. And Halliday's biggest regret was losing his only friend. <clears throat> okay, stop. We close the Oasis on Tuesdays and Thursdays. People need to spend more time in the real world. Reality? Is the only thing that's real. Oh, <laughs> yes. cute! Oh, I that, love was, that. that was directed by Spielberg. What? That was so much fun. That movie was so cool. I loved all the old school throwback references. Literally throughout the entire movie, they were everywhere. Ah. I don't know if you could even spot every one first time watching it. No, but I would kind of like to go through the movie and watch it again and like try to find all the Easter eggs. There were so many. The music. So good. The The music was like the best soundtrack. I it need fit. it. I need it. It fit so perfectly with the movie. It was just so good. I had literally no idea what the story or what this movie was going to be. And that's always kind of a fun way to go into a movie. Like, no trailers, no not like, you knew it was a video game, but you didn't know exactly to what context it was going to be about games. And that shit blew me away. Mm -hmm. I love the way the whole world, and honestly, it's like not even that far away from where we live now in terms of the date, oh, but uh, it's like 20 years from now. Yep. But it's just the way everyone's living in VR and you have your own avatar and you basically are living your life. You just saw people just going by people's windows just in the world, in the oasis. And just the way, just the story just kind of flew through all this different stuff and then really kind of dove into this bigger thing. Yeah. And it was just so cool. I, I mentioned it a couple times but it really felt like a Willy Wonka situation. Yeah. It was where it was really like good. the creator was passing it on to somebody, but it had to be the right person. It had to be somebody that was deserving of it, that cared about it just as much as they did. Exactly. And that's like essentially like you strip down the movies, Willy Wonka and this. It's like that's what it is at its core. It's like it needs to be passed on to someone who you know cares, who you know is going to take care of it, do the right things with it. And not turn it into like this big corporate shenanigans bullshit thing, which word I loved it. I did too. I thought the story was fun. I would watch that shit again and again and again. It's really funny because every time we do a movie night, it feels like that movie is constantly on the movie channels. Because <laughs> now it's like I see every movie that we've watched, and I'm sure they're always on. You just never notice them because you never watched them. But it's like, I bet you tomorrow we turn on the movie channels, we'll see Ready Player One somewhere. Is it World War Z on right now? Uh, I haven't seen World War Z, but I see uh, Hunger Games literally every day. I see John Wick all the time. I see a bunch of the stuff that we've watched recently just popping up in movie channels. Like, oh, hey, look. That's true. There's That's true. 1917 just randomly on TV. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so it's like well, we always... I would love to watch this again because it's so fun. It's yeah. so, like I love the story. It's a really like wholesome story at yeah. its core, and like really good actors. Like everybody like did so well. Oh my gosh, I just and the visuals. Oh, the visuals are everything. The way they were switching back and forth from like virtual to real life was I thought that was excellent. I thought they did a great job, and again I thought the story was really awesome. And it was a lot of fun. And being 80s babies, there was a lot of stuff in there that we recognized from when we were playing video games as a child. Yep. Because besides playing sports, all I did was play video games all up until basically our first child was born. And then I took a big break, and then I got back into it for you know streaming purposes. But it was like, video games were my thing growing up. I'm a little sad, because I saw a bunch of Halo representation in there. When all my friends in college were playing Halo, me and my some of my friends were playing Madden. I didn't see any Madden references in there. I'm a little bummed, but it's fine. It's okay. Not a big deal. But, yeah, I, overall, I just, I thought that was really cool. I mean, the first video game I ever played was, and I think there were a few Easter eggs of it in there, was on the Commodore. I have an older brother. 
He had a Commodore. We played... See, we had an Atari. I think it was a Bruce Lee uh, fighting game, which was probably, I think, my brother's favorite game that I always would play on his Commodore. I mean, we had a we had an Atari I think I played somewhere. Space Invaders for sure. Pong. Pong. Absolutely. For, definitely. Yeah. Definitely dating ourselves here, but it's I don't fine. know what you're talking about. The way it goes. I'm aging backwards. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, I mean, for sure. I wish. But it, it, it hit a lot of childhood stuff. Like the games and the references, and I thought it was awesome. I had a lot of fun. The music definitely drove a mm -hmm. lot of the movie. It was mm -hmm. so good. So, yeah, definitely want to check that movie out again and see what other new Easter eggs you could find. I love that the whole movie was basically geared around finding the Easter egg. I think that's absolutely hilarious. I do, too. So, yeah. Any other thoughts? No. All right. Just really good. Yeah, very much enjoyed that. It was so much fun. So yeah, you guys leave all your comments down below. We'll catch you guys later for the next one. Have a good one. Bye.